Hello and welcome to Excel Video 237. I'm Nate Moore. I just booked airfare to speak for Georgia MGMA and for California MGMA the same week in April. If you're planning on attending either one of those meetings, I'd love to meet you. If you're not planning on attending a meeting where I'm speaking this spring, let's talk. Today what I want to do is take a little bit different approach to that hiding thing. Remember we did hiding last time. We can easily hide and unhide columns. What I want to do is if you're if you've got a spreadsheet where you're continually doing it, you say, boy, you know, I, I'm always hiding these three columns to show this view, and then when I give it to this person, I gotta hide these two columns, but then I hide that one. Let me show you a shortcut that might make your life just a little bit easier. It's not on the home tab, it's over here on the view tab, and it's called custom views. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with, where I don't have any custom views by adding a view called detail, where I'm gonna show all the details. And in, in my view, I'm going to include the way I've got it set to print and the way I've got the rows and columns hidden and any filter settings that I have. I'm going to click OK there. And now I'm close. I'm almost where I want to be. Now let's go through and say, all right, I'm going to hide these three columns here. So I'm going to right click and hide and say, I'm going to hide the commercial column as well. And all I want is, let's come out to maybe something like this. All I want is to show my CPT code, Medicare physician fee schedule, and my reimbursement. That's all I want to see. So I'm going to do custom views. We'll add to that, and we're going to call this Medicare. And then we're going to do one more. And what I can do is I can go back to custom views and show detail. Now everybody's back. And what we're going to do then is we're going to say, okay, this time I'm going to hide Medicare. And I'm going to hide this Medicare. And maybe, you know what, I'll hide my fee schedule too. Let's do that. And again, I've got pretty much what I want. And you know what, this that 45% in the middle of nowhere, that looks screwy too. So you know what, I'm going to hide that row too. And I'm going to go to Custom Views, Add a View. And the way everything's set up now, I'm going to call that Commercial. And click OK. And that's all there is to it. Now that I have my Custom Views set up, I can easily go back and show there's all the detail, custom views. Now I want to show what Medicare looks like, custom views. Yeah, let's do commercial this time. And if I say, ah, I don't need commercial anymore, I can always uh, delete it or I can close out and get rid of that screen. The one caveat, the one catch to all this is custom views works great until you have a table. When you have a table, it blows up and you're not going to get custom views anymore. But if you don't have a table and you're forever hiding and unhiding to get things just the way you want them and then moving it back, Play with from the View tab, Custom Views, and I hope that'll help you. Thanks for watching.